It feels nice, warm, humid, <laughs> summer-like out there. Folks. Yeah, it's big changes from what we had yesterday and what we're expecting for tomorrow. So if you like the warm weather, get outside and enjoy. And there will be plenty of time uh, to enjoy the really nice conditions. You know what? Typically, for this time of year, we're in the mid-70s. So already today, we're above that in the upper 70s, headed towards the 80s. Not close to that record, though, set back in 1983. But the one thing you'll notice when you step outside it's pretty muggy out there. We've got dew points in the mid 60s. Also, very breezy. An active southwesterly wind with a few gusts over 20 for the south coast Cape and Islands. That will keep it a bit cooler there. Temperatures in the lower 70s. Upper 70s in Boston as well as Providence up towards Nashua. But we widen out this shot and you will see we have even warmer weather to the south into the 80s. And that's all part uh, just south of this front that's going to continue to push through New England overnight tonight. Area of showers came on through across central and northern New England really spotty, so many areas stayed dry. But I can't rule out as that front pushes south, an isolated shower or storm later on this afternoon and evening. Best chances for the west and south. But as this front lingers early Thursday, we will see some clouds, perhaps an isolated shower. There looks to be a disturbance that may form along this boundary. Could provide the risk of a shower in the afternoon tomorrow. That's something new in this forecast, but I do think temperatures will be cooler, and with the humidity dropping, it may be hard to get a shower out there. So just keep that in mind if you have plans in the afternoon. I think the clouds, they'll begin to break apart late Thursday into Friday as high pressure builds on in. And sure enough, it's going to be a cool but dry finish to the work week. As for the weekend, take a look at this. We've got another system heading our way. So we'll be increasing the chances of some showers for Saturday, Saturday night. Friday night plans look good as well as for those football games. So today, temperatures well into the 80s above average. Cooler at the south coast, Cape and Islands. Partly cloudy, still a bit muggy tonight. We'll find temperatures back into the 60s. We're noticing the dew points will probably climb into the upper 60s near 70 later on this evening, just ahead of that front. But by tomorrow morning, already some improvements as those dew points will drop back into the 50s by the afternoon. And this is why I think it may be hard to squeeze out a shower or two. Nonetheless, temperatures, wow, big change. 60s near 70, and then again for Friday perhaps a degree or two warmer, but cooler at the coast with that onshore wind. As for the weekend, well, we'll start off Friday with that cool onshore wind. Here's that front coming through. Could provide the risk of an isolated shower late Saturday, but by Sunday, well, that looks to be the pick of the weekend. Partly cloudy, less humid, but look at the temperatures because we'll see highs back into the upper 70s to low 80s, and it really looks as though we'll stay warm as we head into early next week. Chris?